Oh, hi, Karen. How are you? Let me see here. How come this one? There we go. How do you apply? Ay, ay, ay. Commercials. How are you guys doing today? Welcome, welcome. Let me just put some stuff in the comments and we'll get started. Hi, Kathy. How you doing, Mama? Long time no chat. <laughs> okay. Well, the screen looks looks good on YouTube thus far. Let me just put my email information in the chat. Hey, Kirsten, how you doing, girl? I'm good, I'm good. Um, just trying to get the info typed in right here really fast. Oh, come on, computer. Hey, Shakoder. This is, um, while I'm finish, finishing up the typing stuff, this is what I'm going to have in the $5 raffle, and I'll, I'll get more into that. Hi, Irene. How are you? Don't forget to hit the thumbs up, please. I appreciate you guys. Welcome, welcome everybody. Thank you for um, stopping in on this Saturday, which over here, uh, not it's a little gloomy. It looks like it's gonna rain in a little bit and it's cool. Hello to everybody who's in here. Sorry if I uh, missed anybody. Hi Molly, how you doing mama? Sometimes the chat goes a little, I'm like trying to multitask and you guys already know how the chat is. <laughs> okay, so let's see here. Before I get started, um, so this beautiful rainbow glass skull jar has a bunch of goodies. This has over $120 value. We have pendants, real stones, vintage bracelets, vintage brooches um the sterling ring vintage rings that right here it's so funny how this landed right on the skull forehead but this is a sterling brooch we have black glass let me see just a bunch of goodies let me let me open it and show you guys some stuff that's in here i have this beautiful gold brooch I have this beautiful ring. It's just called South Florida low humidity. Oh, you're lucky because it's high over here. Karen, let me see here. Okay, I don't have you, so I'm gonna. Karen, you want to be in the raffle? What? Um, how many? Did you want to do one ticket or did you want to do more? You could get as many as you want. Anybody else? Molly, I already have you for two. Did you want to add an additional two? What else am I showing? We have some. Look at how cool this. Wait, no, that's not it. Um, one. Oh, two more. Okay, Molly. Let's 
get Molly. Okay. Um, we have this beautiful pen pendant cameo. Here's a sterling ring. Let me see here. It's kind of hard. There you go. That's sterling. Hi, Olga. She's like, yay, Molly. Oh, I have this gold filled, uh, gold filled um, brooch, and these are real stones. You guys, I'm like not meant. Look at how cute this um, uh, heart, pink crystal heart pendant is. I believe this is sterling, but it's like gold for me. So. There's a lot, a lot of goodies. I also did add one of the um, modern, one of the modern brooches that I got from China. The, the cute witch with the little black hat. So let's see. Hi, Judy. Yeah, Molly, <laughs> she's a wild woman. <laughs> Uh, so does anybody else want to be entered in the raffle? So, so far I have, I added, let me see here. I added Molly for two more. Karen. Will you bring out the flower band ring? The flower band ring. Which one's that one, Olga? Um, Iris, the raffle is only $5. I'm including this in the raffle too. These are all stones. This is all sterling. And there's a bunch of silver pendants. Um, sterling pendants and brooches and rings. And look at how fun that brooch is. This is worth um, $120 plus. So it's $5 for the raffle. But if you... Okay, you want two? If you do, but let me, let me finish telling you, Iris. Um, if you do, oh, did you like it, Irene? Isn't it better in person? Um, if you do win the raffle, you have to pay the shipping. A lot of, a lot of my um, winners in the past, they've already were purchasing something. So I just threw it in there. But if you're not buying anything and... Um, you win because this is a nice heavy jar you are responsible uh for the okay okay let me add iris let me close this up so i have patty teague okay and then i have two for iris And good luck to, at we will pull at the end of the sale. And let's see if hi Lindsay. Let's see if bronze. Bronze usually picks the winners, my cat. And you don't have if you can't make it towards till the end, then that's fine. Don't worry about it. I will contact you and let you know you won. So there's that. Okay. So let's get started. Let me put the fan yeah. on. This humidity is killing me. <clears throat> Everybody doing good? Hi, Angel. How are you doing, Mama? <clears throat> it was on the preview yesterday. Okay. So let's see here. The flower band. Oh! Oh! The, you mean the sterling one, right? Yeah, I'm going to bring that out. Oh, I'm sorry, Angel. I'm sorry. You know, I'm just still trucking. I'm still trucking. Thank you for stopping in. I hope that, you know, being here with us and what you see, it kind of distracts whatever you're, you're going through. 
Yeah, Irene Wright. <laughs> Bride bonds with catnip. <laughs> All right, let's get started. So today I actually flew to the community thrift store and I got some really cool modern costume pieces. So I've had this one actually before. It's a purse. It's sterling. It's on a very, very long chain. You could throw it over your head. I'm not going to measure it. And it opens. Okay, Angel. No worries. Um, if you don't like the little, um, little clock, you could totally snip it off. You know, that way you could put little secret stashes of something in there and let me see here so let's see how it hangs this is very long like I said I've had one in the past and it's just super adorable and it's good for anybody who collects the little purse necklaces so um, this one will be a buy it now of let's do 13 so I do a lot of, oh, Molly hopped on it. I got you, Molly. I do a lot of buy it nows and I do some, um, a little bit of auction style, but a lot of buy it nows. So if you're lagging, make sure you're refreshed, you're in live chat, you know, um, and then that way we could keep it moving along. Okay. Okay. So this one is actually too stinking cute. And I'm going to keep it moving along. That way when people are not interested in one piece, I'm going to just keep moving forward. That way they could, um, you know, like I don't want to drag the auction for everybody. So this is um, gold tone chain. Let me give you a drop measurement on this. Hi, Sue. What's going on, woman? So the drop on this is eight and a half. That's eight and a half. I want to show you guys how cute this is. So it's a cat. <laughs> it's a cat with angel, an angel cat. And the back says, my guardian angel. And I was like, oh my God, I'm in love with this. I have cats. I know we have big cat lovers out there. I know a lot of you think that your cats are your guardian angels. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna do a start bid on this one of 10 and just let it ride. But I just like how it says my guardian angel on the back. And to be honest with you, this is better in person. I don't like the way it's looking on the screen. No bids, no takers. Oh, this poor kitty angel's not going to go with anybody home today. And it's silver tone and gold tone. I'll give it a few. Maybe it's meant for me to keep it for my bronze and my silver since it has kind of like both colors. Hi, Carly. How are you doing? Do me a favor, right? I need you to write here. Write this name. That one. That one. That one two times. This one two times. And then, no, no, no. I need to write it and make it, it. No, not that one. Okay, never mind. I'll do it. Good, good, good. Write them like on little, like, and put them in the bowl up here. 
Okay, let's pass on this. Let's pass. Nobody wants the kitty. And then I actually picked this up today. So this is black glass. It's very, very long. I'm not going to measure it. It will go over somebody's head probably two times. And check this out. It has, it's a heart and it opens up so you could put, I don't know, it's like a snuff bottle. I'm pretty sure this, um, I've had this one before just by itself and look at their little mini hearts. I had this one before but I sold it by itself. So this is... I want you guys to kind of see it though. It's very, very long. See? Let me see. So let's do a buy it now on this one. Of 18. And I know I have a lot of people who, ah, there she is, Miss Patty Cake with their hearts. There you go, Mama. Got you. I was like, I know I have people who love the hearts and the little secret pouches or little. Congrats, Mama. Thank you for your email, too, Patty. You said you liked all your stuff that you got. Okay, let me do a drop measurement on this. <clears throat> so the full length, um, we're looking at seventeen and a half inches. That's the full length. So the drop would be like eight and a half and some change. Let me show you this necklace. We have beautiful blue green AB crystals. Well, rhinestones. Prong set. I did get this at my local antique store. But let me show you the downfall. There is a crack. See, it's hard. You can't even really see it because it's dark, but there's a crack right there. It's still in place. Look, at it. it's not going nowhere. And if you're wearing it, especially over, like, let's just say if you wore black, you can't tell. I, I mean, you guys can't even tell. I know it because the lady, you know, when I got it, she told me and she wasn't going to really be able to do much with this necklace. But I think it's divine. It's stunning. And it's perfect for, to be honest with you, anything. The holidays, a birthday, an anniversary. So because of the crack, but I still think it's a very um, beautiful piece. Yeah, it is. Um, let's do a buy it now of 18 which it's priced accordingly, but isn't that this piece gorgeous? Ah, Molly, there you go. Congrats. I love this. Look at that. Congrats. just a modern well depending on the year it came out but it's 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 modern it's not old old like the like the last piece I just showed you and let's see here 
the drop on this will be about seven and a seven and a half to eight the drop it's kind of hard because the lettering but I just love this piece it says love and it has blue orange yellow different color rhinestones kind of reminds me a little bit of like Betsy Juicy Couture line and it just says love so this one will be a buy it now of 13 thanks Lindsay yeah okay molly thank you yeah i am um, you know i just want it i want somebody to enjoy it and i know it, it has a fracture in it I, i'm i'm still thinking it'll get a nice few good uses out of it you know congrats molly Okay. Hi, Maddie. How you doing? Okay, so let me give a full... The full length on this vintage gem is you're all right okay well i'll take that the full length on this is about 17 inches so i'm thinking it's the drop is about eight and a half we have beautiful ab glass stones this is either a very very i tested it for uranium glass it's not this is either a very low grade glass or high grade um, acrylic because it's like it's too close but i don't want to say it's glass this is the back look at how beautiful the back is look at that another beautiful vintage gem so this one will be a buy it now of let's just do um 20. let's do 20. oh it might have residue perfume on it i could smell it sniff it for you <laughs> does that discern are you allergic to certain um perfumes so this one's a buy it now of 20. Yeah, I know. Yeah, the blue one. Because when I got it, I thought of you. Because, you know, you and the Betsy. Let's pass on this one. Move it on to the next. And if anybody's watching this after it airs, um, feel free to em email me. If there's some... Well, I was going to put that down there, but bronze is right there. Uh, feel free to email me um, if... It doesn't sell. I got this cute brooch. And it is a porcelain face. Look at how cute. This is a 1920s hat. And it's a it's a modern piece, but it's made to look old. And she has nice little curly hair. 
So this one will be, this pin is a buy it now. Let's do $12. Let's do 12. So the perfume scents on Pearl stays. I wonder if you were to put them in a bag of like, oh, something that would absorb the perfume like um dryer sheets i know dryer sheets absorbs um odor scents okay let's pass on this thank you for everybody who's here I have this really cute uh, crescent moon. It has stars. The dry, well, dryer, the dryer sheets. Some of them don't have scents, but like, let's just say. Um, okay, I'll give you an example. Um, I ordered some handmade little bags, mothball scent. And I could tell that they were they were awesome the bags, but the the person who made them was um, and and no nothing against them, but they're a huge chain smoker. I could I could smell and the the cigarette, and so I had to put them in a bag with uh, dryer sheets, and it it just absorbed the scent. So this one will be a buy it now, if, and it's a brooch. I don't think there's any marks on it. It's in very, very good condition. And let's just do a buy it now of 12. I don't know about rice. I don't know anything about rice. I know rice absorbs moisture. But I don't know how good that is. This would actually... Uh, thanks, Sue. Yeah. Molly, this would actually match the pendant you got. The little, the blue star moon pendant. Okay. Let's pass on this. Kitty litter. I've heard of that too. Clean kitty litter, of course. This was just too stinking cute. I know you guys have seen a bunch of these carved wooden animals. We have a giraffe, a rhino, a lion, a cat. Look at that. It's very, very long wooden beads. I'm not going to measure it. It would go over anybody's head. I just appreciate the artistry behind this. And anybody who is a huge um, animal lover. Very, very cute. Oh, look it. It looks like this. Oh, that's just the bead, <laughs> the red bead. So, um, this one will be, let's just do a buy it now of 10. Buy it now of 10. I'm going to actually hold it. It's too heavy for me to put it on the. Hi, Anitra. How are you doing? You guys, um, I Spy Queen has a channel. Go check her out. She does games, giveaways. Go. She does some fun stuff. Okay, let's pass on this one. Good, good, good.
You're welcome. You're welcome, Mama. So, <clears throat> this um, watch I had, it's brand new in the box. It is by um, Geneva. Well, it says Geneva Platinum. It's brand new. I had to pull it off last time because I had to recheck it. There's the plastic still on there. This is great for a gift as well. I've never seen a cross a watch bracelet like this. And it has gold hearts. Gold hearts and silver crosses. Isn't that cute? So let me give the... And if you need this bigger, you can add an extender. It's like those fold over clasps. So the length on this is, it's like seven and a half to seven and three quarters. Okay. It's brand new. Great for a gift. See? So this one, let's just do a buy it now of, and you get the box and everything. Let's do a buy it now of 13. We have hearts, crosses, mother of pearl um, is encased in the back of the cross. I'm wondering if you could shorten it. Uh, hmm. I wonder if it'll. No, it's not going to hold. Thanks, Molly. Okay, let's pass on this one. Anybody could email me if they're interested. I had a bin to put the jewelry that I'm not selling and bronze is sleeping in it. Ay, ay, ay. This is um this is an also, also a very uh, unique piece that I found. I'm gonna give you the measurement on this. Yeah, yeah, he's sleeping in my little bucket down below underneath my table. So here we have um coral chunks, and I believe this center one right here is oh there goes bronze's hair, is um carnelian. We have coral carnelian this is a homemade artisan piece but look at these beads look at how cool these little glass beads are so i don't know any information if they're murano type of beads if it came from another piece and then they recycled they're just like little mini flowers stacked up Okay, so <clears throat> let me give a drop measurement on this. So the drop is seven and a half inches and would just, the, the reason I gravitated towards this obviously is the coral. Look at the beautiful coral. And I did put coconut oil to give it back its luster. Okay, look at this beautiful carved carnelian. But these beads right here, these beads are very, very unique. Let me see here. They're like little mini flower pots. Okay. So this one will be a buy it now of, uh, 
Let's do a buy it now for $13. $13. Okay, Molly. Thank you. Molly's like, I want that one. I, I know I'm a, I was a sucker for the beads I, I saw them and I was like oh I like these now I have a lot of um, stones and beads that I came across but I just love the pop of color So this one, oh, I love this. It's like a stacked plate of fruit salad. <laughs> right? Look at how gorgeous these are. So these are stained um, mother of pearl. They're stained mother of pearl. This necklace reminds me of my grandmother, like in the 70s. She used to wear, like, well, I wasn't born in the 70s yet, but she would, you know, wear them when I was little. You're like, no, for selfish me. Hey, there's no, there's nothing wrong with that. Um, let me give you the drop on this. So the drop on this is 15 and a half inches. Look at how gorgeous this is. Okay. That's beautiful. So let's do a buy it now of 15 on this one. Buy it now, 15. Okay, Molly is came in first before Irene. Sorry, Irene. <clears throat> I have another fun necklace, so don't get discouraged. Hold on. Hold on. Where is my pin? Molly's like, I'm not messing around today. You're batting a thousand. <laughs> okay, let's see here. This one I fell in love with. And it does remind me of my grandmother. However, she would have probably used a different color, more of like orangey. Look at, these are mother of pearls, mother of pearl, but they have pink in them. Look at how gorgeous this is. This twisted rope of, let me see if I could get it better. There you go. Oh, yes. That is, and it's a, it's a pretty pink. It's really a pretty like Barbie pink. So the drop on this, let me see here, is 12. The drop on this is 12. This is such a gorgeous mother of pearl pink delight. Let's do a buy it now on that one of 15. Buy it now 15. Okay, we're going to pass on this one. No takers. She's better in person. And let's move on to the next. So when I got my um, Victorian lot from the antique store, um, this was part of the lot. 
I know it's very old. I don't know, though, specifically, you know, the era. I've never seen a chain with the little... Sorry, you guys keep seeing my little cat hairs. I've never seen the chain links with, like, little drops of flowers on top. And this is all sterling silver. It is hollow. It's light. It's not heavy. Okay. So this is a, a loop clasp. And let me give a measurement. It's going to be at seven and a half. Seven and a half. Okay. This is solid sterling. Let me see here. Okay, so this one will be a buy it now of 45. <coughs> Thanks, Kirsten. So yeah, this is from the lot that I got from the collection of a great grandmother, a great aunt, and like there's like more that they haven't released. Iris, you got it. I have Iris. She's pretty. 45. Thank you. Iris, do I have your um, registration information? Just email me, please. It's the blue, um, the blue pin comment with, um, email me your information that, you know, like your, your YouTube, well, your, I'm pretty sure your YouTube name and your real name are the same, but maybe not your PayPal email and, um, your shipping address. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, thank you. I have this cute pen, this lovely little lady. It's just cute. Kind of reminds me of Gone with the Wind a little bit. But this brooch, there, I can't see the maker's mark. It's like kind of smushed in. But let's just do a buy it now. Of 10. Buy it now of 10. And she has a pretty bouquet of, or basket of flowers. Okay, Molly. Thank you. Sorry, Lindsay. Molly's sniping in these, these pieces. Excuse me. Okay. Here is a etched carved in. It's a locket and it's a heart. Look at how big. Well, uh, where's my ruler? I'll give you a measurement. So you're looking at almost an inch and a half drop. Oops, sorry. Okay. It's a nice, it's a nice hefty heart. Look at the closure. That's an indicator of how old it is. You open it up. It is stamped sterling inside. Okay. This is not your typical locket. It's very, very old. 100 plus years old. Okay. Okay. So this one will be um, a buy it now of, let's do 35, 35. 
All right, Miss Patty Cake, you got it. <clears throat> thank you, thank you. So does anybody have any plans for this weekend? Like, is anything going on or what's what's happening? This is a very old Victorian era pen. It is solid sterling. Do you see the C clasp right there? It's very sturdy. Probably didn't get a lot of use and it has the number four on the back. This feels like an enamel over a ceramic. These could have been hand painted little roses. Isn't that charming? Let me see here. Let me see if I could get this off. I'm looking at the little... The little marks. I think that those are permanent. So, let me see here. <clears throat> um... If anybody's interested, this one will be a buy it now of 35. Sterling pin with the little roses. Sue, okay, you got it, girl. Thank you. Congratulations. And Sue, I did see your email before I went on, so thank you. Okay. Uh, ha -ha. I'm going to show you a couple more Victorian pieces. Um, oh, you're lurking? <laughs> okay, I hope you feel better. Look at this lovely pen. Pendant, I mean. I'm sorry. The measurement on this is just about two inches. Hey, Kirsten. What's going on, Mama? So I bought this at the local antique store. This is gold filled. This is from the Victorian era. Okay. Now, this is such a gem. Look at the foil inlay. I have not had one in my possession like this. Um, I seen some that were coming out of France. I don't know where this one specifically came out of. There's a good chance it did come from France. Um, I did pay up on this piece and I'm not going to do an auction. I'm just going to do a straight buy it now. And if it doesn't sell, I'll just put it on eBay. But I will give you a discounted price compared to what I would list it on eBay. So this beautiful Victorian pendant with the foil inlay. At first I was thinking, that's not foil. It might be butterfly, but no, it's foil inlay. So this one will be a buy it now of 150 And I, I just think she's just exquisite. She's fabulous. Uh, 
How's the weather over there, Kristen? I love this so much. Look at that. I love the way the women dressed back then. I mean, even like in the 50s, like it's just so different. Well, it's on the verge of raining and the humidity is like 60, 70 percent over here. So kind of like tropical weather. Okay, let's pass on this one. And okay, I'm going to show this piece, but I'm, I'm thinking I'm going to have to list it on eBay. This came from that Victorian lot. It is a pen pendant. This is all, let me see. This is solid 14 karat gold. Look at the little hinge on this right here. I just love how they used to create the jewelry. 100 plus years old. We have seed pearls. The center is a real diamond. Okay, and it, it's a pin pendant. This one, um, solid gold, will be um, a buy it now of 160. I just like to come across these pieces as old as they are. Where where have they been in the world? Who you know, in whose possession were they? Did they um, reside with? And it's just it's awesome. Okay, we will pass. Okay, no problem, Manitra. No problem. We will pass on this one. Now, I have a collection of long chip stones, and I just, I'm trying to collect, like, all the colors. But I have not come across one that's a mother of pearl. And I think this one's just fabulous. Look at the, they're just like, I've never seen chipped mother of pearl stacked up. The length on this is... Let's see here. Well, I should say the drop. The drop on this is 16 and a half inches. So let's see here. 16 and a half inches. She's gorgeous. You could layer her with other necklaces. You could double her up depending on, you know. And this one will be a buy it now of um, 16. 16. mother of pearl chipped it's very very classy okay iris i got you thank you you're gonna love it i i love it and it's i mean just against any strong bold colors it's gonna make it pop thank you thank you congratulations This one is actually very fun. I've never seen one like this. I picked it up today. So it's costume and it's modern. And the drop on this is 
nine and a half. You also collect stones too? Ooh, awesome. I have I have one more coming out. Um, nine and a half drop. It's costume, but let me show you how unique and different that this piece got me. So I'm gonna have to open it up. So the pendant, it opens up. I, I don't think this is old. I think it's modern, but it could have been shoved on the modern, um, on that modern chain. But look, you can put a portrait. Somebody put a piece of lace. It could have been maybe part of their wedding dress, maybe. I just, I love it. I love it. So let me put this back together. I like I like the little secret openings, the little purses. I'm a, I'm such a that's my weakness right there. Well, a lot of things are my weakness, but that I like it. So here we go. Look at that. And you could you could put dry flowers, whatever you want in there. So this side is, um, I think this one's more flat and this one's more faceted. So this one will be a buy it now of, let's just do 13. Let's do 13 on this one. It's just a fun relic piece. There you go. All right, Molly, I got you. Sorry, Robin. I know, I know. It's it's my weakness too. I'm like, ah. Okay. This gorgeous stunner is solid sterling. And look at how cool this is. The design, the flowers. Now, I thought because of the rivets that this wouldn't be sterling, you know, like all of it, but it is. It has a a fold over clasp. I don't think the clasp itself is sterling, but everything else is the flowers. Look at this. I don't know what era. It's very old. Um, that doesn't help, right? Um, I don't think it's it could. Well, it could be native made, but I don't. I, I don't think so. They would. They didn't. They, I, I don't see rivets in their style of, of jewelry. Okay. You see how the design is on these. It's, it's just, it's just an exquisite piece. So I had this featured before, bringing it back. And the drop on this is seven. It's seven solid sterling. So this one will be a start bid. I did pay up on this one, but this one will be a start bid of eighty dollars. This is well worth well worth over one hundred and fifty, easy. But I want to give somebody the opportunity to um, bring this home and enjoy it. Kirsten, all right, Kirsten. Kirsten at 80, thanks, Mama. Isn't it fantastic? Like, this is definitely a conversation piece. You could just tell it's, it's significantly old, too. I know, I know. She's fantastic. Anybody else? If not, I'm going to start calling it. Oh, happy birthday. Is today your birthday? Happy birthday, Kirsten. Everybody put little um, 
party emojis for Kirsten. How old are you, 21? <laughs> I'm just joking. So going once, going twice, fair warning. Oh, okay. So it's an early pre-happy birthday. Hey, I, I do the same thing sometimes. Sold to Miss Kirsten. Congratulations, Mama. Look at that. Yay. Hey, if, um, yes, happy birthday. Enjoy your necklace. Yes. <clears throat> you know, if you are turning 50, 50s, 50 is like the new 30. It really is. I have this, um, is this from Italy? Yeah, this is from Italy. And let me give a drop measurement on this. So we're looking at eight and a quarter, eight and a quarter, okay? Now it's, it has like a gold and silver effect. The thing I love about Italian silver is it looks like gold. Karen, I haven't threw on a price, mama. Hold on, hold on. Okay, and look at it. it's very like relaxed. It's not gonna get like kink up. And you know Italy, they just know how to do it on the jewelry. I love their their metals. Look at that. Okay. So this one will be a buy it now of um, let's do twenty. And you could put um, a really nice pendant on that. Oh, schnapps. Kathy came in. All right, Kathy. Sorry, Karen. Oh, man. Carol. Okay, so Kathy got it. <clears throat> okay well I have another sterling piece however it's a torque so you could put on a short pendant this is sterling this came from Spain I had a big um, batch coming from Spain and let me see let's give a wow it's just gonna go around the neck let's just look at you can open it up let me give you kind of like it's like it's a flat torque okay so it's like this I'm trying to see if I have um it's just a lovely piece so this one let's do I will easily do a buy it now of 20 and this is solid sterling and it's open in the back. That's that's what we call it a, a torque. Caroline, you got it. Okay, let me put this away. I don't want this to. Okay. Um, congratulations, Mama. Okay, speaking of long chipped um, stones, I have this one. This one I picked up. And the drop on this is, oh, wait a minute, wait a minute. So the drop on this will be, 
and it has an extender 12 about 12 inches and you could shorten it these are and I have not come across these type of chips these are Labradorite they're Labradorite chips see the little blue hue peeking through on some of them or more so look at that oh yeah I like look at that blue green flash nice so this one will be a buy it now of 15 labradorite actually let's put it on this one Let me see. Maybe if I add. Let me see if this would help. Oh, you guys see that now? Oh, you want, should I leave the light on, guys? Is it better? Let's see here. Well, we'll try it out. It is getting dim. Okay, we'll pass on this guy. Okay, so on this necklace, let's see here. Uh, on this necklace the drop is about seven and no seven and a half seven and a half it's solid sterling it has is that the front it's a heart with a cross and i'll tell you what the tag says um it's an infinity heart and cross and it's a vintage um dc dc vintage sterling necklace so it's an infinity with the cross and the heart very very cute so this one will be let's just do um a buy it now of 18. It has the infinity heart cross and it's a vintage DC piece look at the chain on that I'll grab something else Okay, we'll pass on that one. We will pass on this one. Now these are, the, this is glass. This is like ocean glass. This long, beautiful pastel -y chip layered. We have pinks, blues, purples. This is glass, these are not real stones and the drop on this is 14 inches 14 inches okay 
So here we have some beautiful pastel sea glass. This one will be a buy it now of 15. Okay, Molly. Woo, she came in swiping. No, why are you sorry? Did you not want it? Oh, you want it. <laughs> okay. Let me write this down, and this will be the next piece up. Okay, I got you, Molly. Okay, so this is the Betsy Johnson bow, mesh bow that, ooh, look at her in the light with the pink and blue. I did smell, <laughs> Molly. You're funny girl. I did smell it. I don't I don't smell anything. I'm not lying. I don't smell anything. But look at how sensational this is. So I did sell one recent not recently, a while ago. Through Betsy Johnson Maker's Mark. Um it, it was black, but I've never seen a blue one. I know I checked the scent. I don't I'm not smelling anything. And I typically have a canine, canine nose. However, when I got COVID, it's still like trying to recoup. I, I, I shoved my nose in there. I don't smell anything. I'm not smelling anything. <laughs> I'm over here sniffing it out. So if anybody wants the Betsy Johnson, uh, let's do a buy it now of $25. Okay, Molly, Molly, I'll tell you what. I don't smell anything. But if you get it and you're like Kimmy, there is a scent, which I don't smell anything though. I will, I will uh, work with you, okay? We don't want you to be dissatisfied. They'll sniff it, sniff it. I'm like I'm sniffing, sniffing like a dog. Okay. Now this is um, this is such a snazzy piece. It is modern. Thank you. Uh, let me see if I could get it under control, though. Uh, we have little, I'm trying to, like, relax it because it's not, there we go. A plus customer. Yes, yes, yes. So this is a modern piece, but I want to show you guys how cool. So it's kind of like hematite and crystals. That's the color effect it's giving me. Okay. V look at the little detail on this though. Okay. I'm going to give you a drop measurement. It is modern. It's not old. Okay. This is um, great for the season right now, too. Tis the season, Christmas coming up. So, um, the drop is about seven and a quarter. Seven and a quarter. We have nice little flowers. It just lays so classy and eloquent. So I'm gonna do a really good deal on this one. Let's just do a buy it now of 13, $13. This one is better in person to be honest with you. I think it would lay prettier on this one maybe.
Okay, we will pass on that one. Um, let me take this off. Okay, I have these fantastic stretch bracelets. I have two of them. So I'm going to give one price, and if two people want them, they could take them. So the faceted clear, this is faceted clear quartz. The clear one is real stone. Now, when I was testing the amethyst colored one, it was hitting as glass, which kind of threw me off because I would think that they would put amethyst with real, you know, uh, crystal quartz but it, they're still beautiful they're stretch bracelets I mean they're very very fun so I have two of them so um, each one will be a price of you just I have two available uh, buy it now of ten dollars oops so I have two And they're 10 each. Real um, crystal quartz with glass, purple glass. Okay, Caroline. I'll, I have one left. Does anybody else want this one? Okay. All right, Caroline. Woohoo, you got one, girl. You want both? Oh, beautiful. All right. Sounds good. Thank you. Thank you. So, um, thank you. During, um, the Victorian era, this type of jewelry was developed and these are a operculum and what it is is marine snails underneath in the ocean and they kind of look like little eyeballs huh <laughs> but they're the little snail trap doors so this is probably circulated from the 50s and they just glued it on I don't know if it came from an older piece um, operculum is very expensive when you can find a full, you know, Victorian um, hardware and whatnot. But this is this is not Victorian. This is I would say 50s. But um, what's the measurement on this? The measurement on this. It's about, oof, it's, it's a hair, yes, yes, that's what I said. It's like the little trap door inside a marine, um, inside of a marine snail. So, um, oh, I, I measured it. Oh, it's a hair shy of seven and a half, like a slither sh shy of seven and a half. And if you want to make it bigger, you could um, get an extender, like a fold over clasp. This would work. But this one is going to be a buy it now of, and I'll do a really good price on this, 20. Oh, Angel, you have the necklace. Navajo made that's awesome yeah there's like a whole thing about this type of um, genre that came out and
the Victorian era. Oh, it's sterling. Oh, yeah. Yeah, that's good. Okay, we will pass on this one. I think I'm just going to have to probably list it on eBay. Hi, Deborah. How are you? Okay, here I have operculum shell. Yes. Here I have some Chinese um, porcelain beaded beaded strand of necklace. Let's see here. Ooh, I have come across a few of these. The drop is eleven, almost eleven and a half. So I have come across, and there's silk knotted in between, made very, very well. I have not come across this style, this like hourglass bead look. And look at how cute the little clasp is, the enamel clasp. Looks like there's a mark right there. No, that's not a mark. Look at the clasp. It's too cute. I love this. We have Chinese glass, I mean Chinese porcelain. And let's just do, uh, this one actually will look better. Right here. There we go. Let's just do a buy it now on this one. Uh, let's do 20. I'll do 20. I did pay up almost as high as that but I want to give somebody a fair opportunity to own something like this okay Iris thank you you got it mama I have these fun modern let me get a measurement though see I used to measure every little piece I got and it just took I just don't have the time so I'm doing it in the auction I'm sorry but it does help pass along the time so the drop on this necklace is eight and a half eight and a half and it's gold tone it's modern but we have hearts so i got these at a fabulous price i got two of them so i have two available maybe somebody wants to stack them oh wow look at that i wasn't even planning that but that looks gorgeous right so i have two and let's just do a buy it now of nine dollars nine dollars for the gold tone hearts they look a little graduated they're a little graduated it actually looks really cool like that let me see here Let me see if this works. Oh, there you go. I just double stacked it. It looks pretty. I'm trying to do, I'm trying to work with it one hand and it's not working. There we go. Uh, it needs to be pinched up a little bit more. Oh, no, I have it. I have it. I'll whip that out right now. I 
I know those pieces are so cool there you go look at that that's a whole thing right there so if somebody wants both of them I'll do a better price than nine each I'll do a better price but let me see let me try to find that um that brooch Irene is talking about Karen, do you want one or do you want both? Okay, I'll give them both to you for 15 Instead of um, $9 each, I'll give them both to you for 15 Congratulations. No, 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 thank you. I, I wasn't even planning on stacking them up. They just look so divine like that. Okay, before I show the brooch that um, Irene is inquiring about, I know I showed, I featured this um, in my preview. Isn't she divine? I'm keeping her. She is signed. She's hand-painted. Isn't she lovely? Look at that. Oh my god. I love this. I love this. She's going in my antique collection of pins. Okay. So. This is the one you were talking about, right, um, Irene? I call these the jello brooches, the gelatin. There's like a flower inside. Oh, thanks, Irene. I will. I will. And I actually have a few of these, but she's she's good. So this one, let's just do a buy it now of 12. Okay, Irene. You got it. Thank you. Congratulations, Mama. I like the black with the pink and the yellow pop. It's so cool. Okay. Is anybody interested in Amber who has a small wrist? Because I've I've had this cuff and I'm not too sure. It's smaller than two and a half. It's like two and a quarter. If anybody's interested, let me know. This is Baltic Amber, solid sterling. I got this a while ago and um, I'm not going to make any money on it. I'm just pr pretty much going to get what I spent on it. Because it's a very... Look at that. Look at that chunk. Let me see here. Oh, that's cool, Irene. I'm trying to find my... Uh... Here it is. Let me see. Okay, I don't know if you guys could see. Let's look at the little glowy glowy. Let's turn this off. So you guys see that? Ooh, look at that glow. Nice. Okay. So um, this is solid sterling um it might be from poland i remember i got a bunch and a lot of it was from poland the ring sets and all that let me give it inside measurement 
and yeah that's the inside measurement so it's like a hair it's about two and a quarter two and a quarter it does have a safety um, little chain so if anybody's interested let's just do a buy it now of 90 You know what? Um, well, I'm about, I know two and a half is a standard seven inch wrist. So it, it would be, it would be smaller, really, really small, probably like, I don't know, six, six and a half. Does it, would anybody know where the two and a quarter I should know this and I, I do, but then I forget because my brain Wi-Fi doesn't work. I'm thinking it definitely would have to be six and a half and smaller. Oh, you're a seven. Yeah, no. Um, I'm a seven and you know, I can't, I can't get it on. Yeah, about a six and a half. I'm sorry, Deborah. Stunner, right? Okay, we'll go on to the next one. Now I have this open cuff, beautiful um, coral turquoise inlay. Yeah, six and a half or less. Okay, okay. This is, this came from a native lot that I got. There is nothing signed on it though. Nothing at all. This came from a lot where I bought the uh, Victor C necklace. Um, and that actually ended up valuing for a lot of money so this is a cuff it'll fit a small tiny wrist and you could like pinch it in I am a seven inch so it fits me you could open it up a little bit more Let's look at how lustrous and creamy that coral is so um, this one will be a buy it now of uh let's do 95 95 well i am digging for something else is it me or is today going by fast or no am i insane It is going by fast, right? Yowza. Okay, let's pass on this. And let's see here. So I have this. Um, this is a size... Eight and a half, eight and a half. We have marcasites, amethyst. It's just a beautiful style. This is on sterling. Is there any maker's marks? Um, no. But for this ring, look, we could do a buy it now of 22. 
reminds me a little bit of this design of like kind of like Hollywood Regency just a smidge okay Caroline you got it I have this um, sterling cross and it's actually a it's it's a hefty it's a it's a big one we're looking at two and three quarters it's solid sterling I like the wrap on this cross it reminds me of the cloths that um, Jesus wore and it is from Mexico Hold on, Karen. I haven't um, given a price, Mama. It's it's huge. It's huge. So I'm going to give a very fair price on this. Let's do a buy it now of... Let's do 25 Let's do 25 You still interested, Karen? <laughs> you still interested, or is, th is there a lag? It's it's an awesome artisan piece. Like, look at that. Okay. Sterling silver moonstone brooches. Um, oh, it's okay, Karen. Let's pass on this one. Um, not that I can think of. Sterling silver moonstone. Yeah. Not, not at the top of my head. Oh, check this out. Now, I've had this for a while. This is Zuni pen pendant. It is native made, and yes, that's how they signed the jewelry pieces. You could wear it on a necklace. It's solid sterling. We have opal inlay with turquoise. Um, most likely, this is lab opal. It's not real. It could be, though, but I think a lot of native pieces were made with the lab opal. Right, Angel? And look at this cute Zuni turtle. Okay. So, um, for this little guy, thank you, Angel. Let's just do um, a buy it now of, uh, for today only, let's do a buy it now of 35. 35. Pin pendant. Okay, no takers. I'm going to have to list this one on eBay. Let's pass on this one. No biggie. Let me see if this is from Italy. I think it is. Where's my magnifier? Chewed a medical document? Oh, no. You know, my cats chew on stuff like dogs, too. But they don't eat it. They just, like, chew on cardboard and stuff. So this chain right here is from Italy. 
Okay, I want to show you. Look at the rope. It's pure silver. Let me give a drop on this. Sometimes we just need like a nice, slinky, good chain, you know? So the drop on this is, oh, hold on. Uh, nine and a half, nine and a half inches. Oh, there it is, nine and a half. It's from Italy. It's not, it's not, um, it's not thin. It's, it's nice and thick, durable. Okay, and you could put different pendants on it from Italy. So for this chain, let's do a buy it now of, let's do 30. Buy it now of 30. Did you like Karen? Did you get one of those poodle um pins? I think you did. Maybe not. Did you like it? Isn't it better in person if you did? Let me put this right here. Somebody was asking me about a flower ring that I had earlier. The Sterling Flower Band. I forgot who it was. Oh, okay. Mills backed up. Let's pass on this one. So this is a size... Uh, I want to say six and a quarter comfortably six and a quarter it's a flower band look at that it's solid sterling isn't that charming your mail is always slow who who inquired about this earlier was it Deborah I don't know who it was. Maybe they had to leave. Okay. Well, this is um, a sterling ring. Let's just do... You wish it was bigger? Yeah. Let's do a buy it now of $12. Buy it now of $12 beautiful um, row of flowers on a band no but it's pretty who oh, I forgot who it was that was inquiring about it yeah do I have any more torques um I don't I have short sterling um, necklaces similar to Torx, but they're not they have a clasp in the back they're not the the open part of the back of the necklace is what makes it the torque so if you want to look at that i could show you okay patty thank you your fingers need to stop eating Okay, this is a size um, six and a quarter, the same, six and a quarter. You need a 16 inch sterling chain. Um, so you need the drop to be eight, in, like total 16 inches. So this is solid sterling, it's six and a quarter. It's just a nice, thick, chunky, abstract ring. So this one will be a buy it now of 15. Okay, Karen, let me look. I have, 
a lot of different chains. So if, if it's a little bit bigger than that, is that okay? Or you want it right at 16? Okay, do me a favor right now so I don't forget, email me as a reminder, say, don't forget to look for a total length 16 inch sterling chain. Because I do have a bunch of sterling chains, but the, the sizes, I have a lot of long ones too. If you could do that for me, mama. All right, let's pass on this one. Thank you, Karen. I just think this is so great. These are, um, these take hours and hours to make. These are glass seed beads. They have the um, double toggle. They're different hues of blues. Let me give you a measurement. Um, I had this one for a while. And, you know, this takes, well, more than hours. It takes days to create. So we're looking at a measurement of seven. Seven on the last loop. And you could tighten up right here to make it probably like six and a half. Isn't this gorgeous? It is beautiful. So let's just do a buy it now on this one of $12. Is that your dog, Karen, or is that you? <sighs> uh oh. Are you scolding your dog? Stop hitting the button. No, I think it's her doggy. You guys, this piece right here, it is, it's, it's beautiful. It's so much better in person. Like I can't, I, I just, I don't know. Oh, Donna. There you go, mama. All right, Donna. Thank you. Don, oh, you know what? Uh, it was probably too, f Donna, did you get your package? Probably not so, right? Cause it's too soon. exquisite pieces on its way all right all right i have this you made two of those it took days yeah it does take days it does it is okay so i have a multi-stone silver pendant this is from Spain it looks like we have a peridot um, garnet uh, rose amethyst citrine looks like Madeira citrine it's just it's just a really nice classy pendant hey late um, late but it's okay you're still here so let's do this one for a buy it now of $22. And this one is from a lot I got from Spain. You know how Spain does it. All right, Iris, thank you. Love you too, Joni. Love you too. I have this um, abalone. We have pearls. Look at the pendant on this. 
This also came from the lot of Spain. And the drop on this is two inches. Two inches. So cool. Look at the abalone. It has like some psychedelic colors. Like it's just the cut on that is really good. I like the way they mastered that. So let's just do a buy it now of 22 as well on this one. With the design on the top. All right, Iris, you got it, Mama. Okay, this I feel was convert. Let me give the measurement. I feel like this was converted, like from old piece with new modern metals. So the drop on this is eight, eight and three quarters. Okay, and it could be shortened. Okay, so let me show you. It's a modern metal, and then they attach these glass seed beads but I want to show you what drew me to this piece there's like an inlay see the psychedelic colors of the abalone there's like an inlay and these upside down hearts there's rhinestones little chandelier black glass beads and then it just has a lot of little detail Let's put this up. And you could shorten it. See how it lays? It's just a gorgeous piece. It's very, it's delicate, small. Um, so let's just do a buy it now on this one. Um, for thirteen dollars I would wear it Halloween all year round this black design reminds me of like um, okay Iris I got you it does remind me a lot of the Victorian era not necessarily the like the inlay just the design the selection of stones and all that sorry Deborah and Joni I had, um, Joni, if you go to the beginning of my video after I'm done, I have, I have one that's delicate like that, that I don't think it's sold, or maybe it did. <laughs> I can't remember now. Um, does anybody interested in shopping for cufflinks for men? Yes, Iris, right? So I fell in love with this gold sway box. And look at this. This is an original traditional award collection, Sears, the men's store. Look at that. Cufflinks um, for the tie. I mean, and it's clean. Like they, I think they bought it or they got it as a gift and just put it away. I just, I'm also on the hunt for old antique boxes. Like that's like my new, my new thing that I want to start collecting. So if anybody's interested, we'll do a buy it now on this one of $16. Caroline, you got it. You got it, girl. Isn't it fab? It's really rare. Well, I mean, you you can't... From time to time, you could come across them. But when they're, like, 
in that mint condition, it's even more exciting, you know? I know, me too. Okay. I don't know. I just think it's fun. It's enamel. We have crystals. They're little palm trees. It's a pin. It's modern. So if anybody's interested, let's do a buy it now of $10 on the palm trees. This totally goes with uh, Cali or Florida, Miami weather. The palm trees, right? It's in really good condition too. I think I might just have to keep it for, let's see here. We'll just put the little palm trees right here since I am Soho, California vintage. All right. Okay, let's pass to the next item. Now, look at this. Irene, you want the palm trees? You want the palm trees? Congratulations. Okay, the next item, look at how cute this little lizard is. He has green, emerald colored eyes, beautiful butterscotch stones. Over here, the palm trees. I, okay, I got it, girl. He's just divine. Like, you wear him going up the shoulder... We call lizards over here Lazarios. That's it. Well, I got it from my boyfriend. He calls them Lazarios. So let's do this one a buy it now of $12. $12. Thank you for everybody who's here. Um, I know I had some people step in late. I also, uh, as a reminder, I have a $5 raffle. This is over $120 worth of jewelry. There is a lot of sterling, a Brighton bracelet in there, um, vintage earrings, uh, sterling rings, a lot of a sterling necklace and a bunch of pendants. Just, you know, some good stuff for just a five dollar raffle if you're interested let me know before we call at the end of the um sale i know he is cute look at him look at him look at him he's shaking his tush okay let's pass <laughs> you want one uh for the raffle And you could buy as, um, as many as you want, Angel. Where's my pan? Okay. Okay, I got you, girl. Two more for the raffle, Iris? Okay. Okay, so I, I'm going to have you at a total of um, four, right? And then Caroline, Caroline. Okay. I have Caroline. So I have Angel for one, Iris for two more, and then Caroline for one. Okay. 
Let me just write this down real fast. <coughs> Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. Let me just write this down. All right. Let's see here. I got this ring. Thank you. You registered for the raffle? Let me see how. Okay. Uh, did you get one? Um, Joni? Okay, let me write that down. I gotcha. Okay. This is a sterling, thank you ladies. This is a sterling ring. We're looking at a size seven. It does remind me of Art Deco. It's, it's oval. They're CZs, they're not real diamonds. Let me see. Yeah, they're not. Seven. Okay, I remember I paid up on this ring. It just, I wish it fit me better. It does remind me of the Art Deco. So, um, this will be a buy it now of, let's do 20 I wish it fit me. That's a beautiful engagement style ring or wedding ring. Okay, we'll pass on this one. No big deal. We will pass. I picked this up and I was like, it's non-jewelry, but I just couldn't help it. And it is very pretty, right, Karen? Do you remember these headbands? What era was this? Like the 70s and the 80s? And it's made out of beads. Are they glass or plastic? Ah, they feel like... I think they're just plastic. But they're, it's a headband. And you wear it over, and it has like a beautiful cognac color. So if anybody wants the headband, let's do a buy it now of 13. 13. And these are fun to wear. I know somebody's thinking about it. They're like, oh, I used to wear those. Are you? you know? Okay, well, let me know. We'll pass on this. Let me see here. Nobody on the kitty. I have this long articulated turtle. Look at his little tail and everything. He's cute. It's a very, very long chain. It'll fit over the neck. And it has like an extender. Um, this is modern. Let's just do a buy it now of 20. I mean, not 20, 12. I'm sorry, 12. My brain, yowza. He's cute. So this is how he would look. Uh, he's cute and he's a little fat.
turtle. Okay, we'll pass on this guy. I know, he is cute, right? Okay. This is a long sterling chain. Uh, let me see, is this one from Italy? Uh, I don't know where the chain is from. But I added it on this um, pendant. This pendant also came from Spain. We have... Okay, Deborah, let me, let me write that down really fast. Thank you. Deborah Barnes, and you said you wanted two. Okay, thanks, Deb, Deborah. Okay, so on this one, oh, thank you. We have rose quartz, um, peridot, labradorite in the center. I don't know if you could see the in the center the flash. There it is, the flash of blue. So beautiful. So this pendant is artist um, artisan made. It came from Spain. This is a very, very long chain. Let me measure. Ooh. So the drop on this chain is past 12 inches. It's long. It's very, very long. Look at that. Gorgeous. So this one, let's just do a buy it now of 65. That's a very fair price. buy it now 65 and then you could also the chain is versatile you could swap out the pendant and put something else on long chains are great you know and they're in for the people who feel like um they're not being um you know choked around the donna you want the 13 dollar headband okay let me see what it what did i do she's all i froze Okay, let me write that down. You got it. Aren't those cool, Donna? Kind of takes us back, right? Mm-hmm. Okay, I got your headband, Mama. Okay, we'll pass on the necklace. We will pass. I'll just leave her hanging right here. Now, I've had these rings. I think this one's both. Oh no. And they are fabulous. And I don't know, it's like the sizes are not. So this one is um, adjustable. It's black onyx, it's artisan. It's a nice chunky black sterling silver ring. It's adjustable. So if anybody wants this, let's do a buy it now of, let's do 28.
Man, the humidity is high right now. I'm like burning up with these lights too. This is the side profile. Okay, we'll pass. And um, I have pink agate. Let me see her. Ew. Let me see what the size is. The size on this ring is eight, size eight. Size eight, it's artisan, sterling silver. Look at that. I like the ribbed frame around it. It's just a pink agate, a little bit of purple in it. So this one will be a buy it now of um, $28. And it is massive. Okay, we'll pass on this one. We'll just put that back up. And let's just show this one. This is about seven and three quarters. We have sterling silver. Look at how pretty the agate on this and this one is. Seven and three quarters sterling. That's the back. This one's gorgeous. Look at that. This is one of my favorite finds. The cut is beautiful. So let's do a buy it now on this one of 35. Iris, you got it. Thank you. Thank you, thank you. Now, I have this. This is eight and three quarters, almost nine. Eight and three quarters. I believe this one was made in Thailand. Let me see here. Oh, and I think it's uh, like a Chinese turquoise. Where's my loop? Yeah, this this one is um, from Thailand. So this is like a type of like a, either a Chinese turquoise or a rainforest jasper. I can't pin it down. It just, it has a lot of properties that are similar to both. But I want you to look at the design. Look at the inside. You know when they design the inside, like, that's on a whole other level. So this one, let's do a buy it now of $28. $28. It's real stone and sterling from Thailand with the inside. Okay, Iris, you got it. Thank you. You're going to like these rings. They're beautiful. They're better in person.
I had got some modern, thank you. I had got some modern, modern pins from China. I'm not gonna go through all the ones I have left, but I do have two of these beautiful rhinestone elephant ones. They are nice, heavy, durable. Look at that. So these will be, uh, I have two of them, but these will be a buy it now 15. I just like the color, the design. Isn't he cool or she? Could be a girl or a boy. Okay, I don't think we have no takers on this one. It's okay. We'll pass. Let's see here. Isn't, isn't she so cool? Okay. Now, I actually have three left of, th I think maybe four. This is acrylic. I want you to look at, look at the layering of acrylic. It is a modern pin, but isn't she adorable with her little purse? And her like scarf hat. So this one will be a buy it now of 13. And I have four of them. I have four. Yeah, I have four. And then she cute. Oh, look at that. Okay, we'll pass on Little Missy. Little Missy. I do have this fun acrylic toucan bird. It's modern very vivid in colors i like the cut they're made really well they're made really well so i only have this one left and this one will be a buy it now of 13. little birdie i don't know who got the other one this would actually look fantastic with those that palm tree brooch that irene got Okay, let's pass. Let's pass. Is that it? <laughs> it's up to you, you know, because this may not do nothing for you. I think it's just so snazzy with those palm trees. <laughs> you know? I, I do love those palm trees you've got. They're just made, it's, it's modern, but it's made really well. Um, all right, I'm not gonna go through everything, everything. Uh, let me see here. Okay. I still have these little hipster girls. Aren't these cool? They're acrylic, they're stackable. This one has her purse, this one has her articulated lips purse. This one is like, um, kind of like a camouflage look. 
So these each, just tell me which one if you like one, is a buy it now of 13. Each are a buy it now of 13. Look at, she has like little bell bottom pants. So cute with her bow. Her lips. Okay, let's pass on this one. Oh. oh, there goes that one. Oops. Oh, man. I'm sad. I got this. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, I dropped one. We have a murder scene. Oh, no, Molly. The one you wanted. She got beheaded. <laughs> Molly, I'll try to keep an eye out if there's another one like this. Oh my god, look at, there's a crime scene all over my floor right now, I'm sorry. Oh man. Go figures, you want the one that um, she got beheaded. I have to be really, really careful with these. Oh, so sad. R.A.P. Just wear her head. <laughs> Deborah, she's like, just wear her head. Okay, I have two of these, and I think she's so beautiful. Look at, she's like a 1920s. She's holding her umbrella. Look at that, right? Uh, let's do a buy it now of 13. Can I, can I, um, what Molly? You want the head? <laughs> I have two of these. Hi, Judy. How you doing, Mama? I still have your ring. And I have some stuff for um, the baby. Okay, we'll pass on this. Um, Molly, you want, you want me to see if I could get another one like that? Or you want the head? <laughs> Yeah, that's true. Okay, so I have... Okay. I only have one of these. It looked like a clean cut. It did. <laughs> Molly, I was... Does the head have a clip on? Okay, let me look. I just I just put her in the in the thing. I'll just give her to you. Don't worry about, you know. I mean, she you know. Anyways, uh, this is a buy it now of thirteen. Somebody said um, this reminded them of Jackie Kennedy. Okay, Molly, you want this one? Molly, I know you want the other one if it has a pin on the head, but did you want this one? 
Oh, okay. All right, Deborah, congratulations. Let me try to see. Um, let me see here. Let me see. Let me let me look at the Oh, you know what? She does Yeah, she does have a pin in the back of her head. So it's just her head. I'll I'll give her and and I'll send the rest of the body. Um Oh my god you could glue her i'll send i'll give her i'll just give her to you molly r.i.p just don't put the head in the fridge like dalmer okay I'm just saying. <laughs> all right you got it i have let me see how many do okay I it is cute. It actually worked out. Try not to laugh, Angel. <laughs> I have this uh, abstract Marilyn Monroe. I actually have a few of these left. Look at that. Trigger finger. <laughs> Look at that. She's gorgeous. So this one is a buy it now of 13. I have a few. I have a few of these left. Miss Marilyn. Oh, and last week when I was showing you guys the Betty Boop ones I had, I have no more. And I was like, oh, there's something wrong with them. And I was like bummed out. That's actually how they're produced. Because I was looking at the ad of where I got it from. And they're identical. So that's that's how they're made so actually there's there's nothing wrong with them okay we'll pass on this one and i don't know if i showed this one no i, I didn't so i have a few of these left there's a really cute girl with the bunny acrylic chic lady putting on her lipstick so these are each um buy it now 13 and i actually have doubles of these so you just tell me which one you want something so charming about this one too she's holding the rabbit look at the layers of acrylic the way they cut it out and so 3d this is like a pink pearly um outfit dress Okay, we'll pass on these. I gotta be careful. I'm not trying to be head anymore. I have this owl. Oh, you, Deborah. I I had way more. I, I think like 150 of of them. Here's an owl. Really cute with a little birdie. Let's do a buy it now of 13. I went bonkers. Oops, sorry, I'm out of the camera frame. Yeah, I don't want to spend too much time on them to show you guys. All right, let's pass on this one. 
All right, I'll show a few more. I'm not gonna show all of them. Um, I think, let me see here. Okay, these are the last ones that I have. I have just, this one is actually in the raffle. I threw it in the jar, it's in a plastic. So she's like a witch, little kitty in the hat. This is kind of like emulating Red Riding Hood. And then here we go. Look at this chic pink hot. The Devil That Wears Prada maybe? I don't know. So I have doubles in these but there's only one left of each. And these will each be a buy it now of 13. Just tell me which one if you're interested. And I also have this one. She has little heart earrings with her little heart sweater. Super cute. I like the little articulated earrings. This one's so cool. Look at the little cat. It's like bewitched. Okay, we'll pass on these. I also have this one. I actually have a couple of these. If anybody's interested, it'll be also buy it now of 13. Yeah, I know. I don't want to drop them on their heads. Okay. I'll just put this on back. Yes. And have let me see here. Two um, remaining rings. One is a size four and one is a size one and a half. So anybody who could fit it on their pinky or on a little for a little girl. But I'm gonna show you how cool these are. And I, I sold the other ones. Um it's like the mountains, ocean with the sky, see the bird, and it could be like the sun. They're inlays. That's a lot of work. Tiny little sterling rings. So this one is a size four and this one's one and a half. And they are each um, a buy it now of 15. <laughs> Deborah's like, I could see why you bought 13. Oh my God, um, Carly bought like 20 plus I think they're on their way to Canada they are so cute Okay, let's pass on these. I think it's kind of um, slowing down. Let me see what else I have. Yeah, I still do have some more dogs. 
breakfast at Tiffany's. I think I have a few more of those too. So this is an abstract elephant. It kind of looks like there's leaves and flowers. Monet designed this. It's a really, I would have never thought Monet came up with this concept. But the drop on this is about 10 inches. Okay. Look at that. Isn't that great? And it kind of looks like the shape of a heart. So this one will be a buy it now of 20. Buy it now of 20. Let me see if you guys could see. You know what? That ain't going to help. There we go. I'll leave it right there. Yeah, dog ones. I'll pull up the ones that I have of dogs if you want. Like, they're stinking cute. They're like on a whole other level. Yeah, it's an elephant. An abstract elephant. These are, uh, Deborah. these are some of the ones that I have left. This is a rabbit with the hat. A dog <laughs> with the pipe. Here's another dog. Boston Terrier. Isn't he cute? And then I have a little mouse with the coat. Cute, huh? I know. These are like out of control cute. Okay, um, yeah, it was fun, very, very fun. Okay, so I think I'm going to start getting ready for the raffle. Let me see if there's anything else. Oh, sorry, if there's anything else I have here. Hmm. You know what, uh, I have a few more pieces to show that I've had for a while, and then I'm going to do the raffle. Um, let's see here. So I have these two amber sterling silver pens. We have a mixture of Baltic, green, amber. Aren't these lovely? So they are each um, a buy it now. Let's do a buy it now of 28 each. And you just tell me if you want one or two. Um, and we'll, we'll move it on. But this is real amber with sterling and they are brooches.
Okay, we'll pass on these. No big deal. Um, no, I'm I'm feeling <laughs> I'm feeling tired. I'm gonna try to start invoicing tonight, and then I'm gonna have to start on laundry. How fun, right? <laughs> okay, let's. Okay. So does anybody else want to enter the raffle? We have $120 worth of jewelry. We have gold filled, a bunch of sterling brooches, real stone, marked, unmarked. Um, yeah. Let me know. Let's see here. I'm going to point it down a little bit. Um, let me get the last... Okay. I know, isn't the jar so cool for the season? I gotta go find Mr. Bronzy and let me get these last names. And he's gonna pick. I'm just getting the last few names in, putting them on papers, squishing them down, mixing them up really good. Let me grab bronze. So good luck to everybody. There's for the jar. And bronzy, come on. Come on. Come on. Okay. Well, we gotta we gotta show everybody that we're we're gonna pick names. Look at all the names in here. Look at if he's not if yeah, I think he's like half asleep. Bronze. Here, help mama. Pick one. Here. Come on. I just need one. Did you get one? No. Come on. Come on. Oh, no. Don't eat it. Okay. Thank you. <laughs> he got one, guys. He got one, okay? Dun, dun, dun. Yolanda, woohoo, congratulations, congratulations, Yolanda, bronze got you, girl, all right, you guys, thanks for being a part of the raffle, thank you, bronze, I know you're half asleep, huh, Yolanda, this hefty rainbow skull is going to be going your way, mama, you guys, thank you so much for everything. Thanks for the support. Thanks for being here. Without you guys, I wouldn't have this. So I appreciate each and every one of you. Stay kind to one another. You guys have a beautiful rest of your night, weekend, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.